TFNN Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Welcome back. Uh, welcome, folks. Uh, Dow is uh, right next to that 23,000. Closed up $41 at, uh, here we go, 22,999 point It's going to make it. It's going to, they're going to get it over the 23,000. They got another four or five minutes to get it over it. It's four o'clock, but they do, uh, trades can go on till about uh, 10 past uh, four. You get the uh, S&P right now, uh, up, uh, one point, uh, 2559. The NASDAQ uh, also went positive. Uh, it's at 66.23. Gold contract down $15.70, trading at 1287. You had the silver contract off 30 cents, $17.06. That being said, they didn't uh, get to hammer the gold. And, well, they got to hammer them slightly uh, early in the day, but the bottom line, uh, they rejected the gold and silver equities, rejected the lower price, had lighter volume. They still want to go topside. Um, Oil market, oil market up 11 cents, $51.98. And oil, the API numbers are going to be coming out at 4.30 this afternoon. We'll have them right after the close at 4.30. IBM is going to be coming out with their numbers, Lim Research, uh, Cree. Uh, so uh, those three, uh, IBM in particular, uh, will be able to move the Dow uh, up or down. IBM looks like it's uh, going to basically not make its numbers once again. 10-year note, 10-year note flat, 128.25.13. 30-year bond up eight ticks, 153.31. Both notes and bonds rejected lower price once again. They want higher price, lower yield. Uh, King dollar, King dollar up 209 ticks, trading at 93.370. If we go over just to the broad market here and take a look at these volumes, the SPY made a new high with 28 million shares. The NDX 100, the three Qs made a new high with 12 million shares. Pretty amazing. I mean, you're talking about anemic volume beyond belief, folks. There's no buyers in, no sellers, but it's grinding higher. Uh, inside the NYSE, we did uh, 608 million shares. That is the uh, indices. Inside the NASDAQ composite, we did 1.629 uh, million shares. So what you can expect, we're going to get out here tonight after the close. We'll get a little volatility. Uh, IBM... Um, bottom line, they're coming out uh, right now. They're going to be coming out with numbers right now, and uh, we'll see where uh, they're going to be. Stay right there, folks. We'll be coming back with all those numbers for you. Had the Dow Industrials finish up 39, NASDAQ up 1, S&P's up 3 quarters of 1.